That's good. doing well let's take a walk around the layout and see what's new of course seems to be the theme lately I've been adding lots of corn and sure enough I've added more but right here not only did I add corn but I added this really neat tractor from Walters it wasn't too bad to put together it's a neat little kit of course, I set up the scene where they're starting to cut the corn. I have a truck sitting next to it collecting the, collecting the corn. And I put the waste behind on the ground. The truck's not quite the scale. It's a matchbox truck. But once, once I find a truck that is appropriate to scale, I'll put that there in its place. But for now, it fills that in and finishes that little scene. There's also, that came with the tractor, that trailer back there that has a grain cutting head up sitting on that. Now I just have to find the, the bins, the grain bins, to finish the scene and of course finish that structure there. You know, those bins are really hard to find right now. Walking around over here. You see I've started another cornfield here. It's an extension of that cornfield back there. You can see the red tractor. So this in the Y here will be a cornfield. Over in here will be a hay field along with here for the cattle that are here at the farm. Head to Tawas here. I've done a few things here that are kind of cool. Of course, more corn. That little corn field's getting bigger, so that whole corner will be filled. But I picked up this house here. This is made by Woodland Scenics. And it's a neat little house. It comes fully assembled and painted and detailed and lit. And I did buy the the plug and play unit from Woodland Scenics to light that up. Yeah, these are these are nice buildings by Woodland Scenics. Um, kind of like the Menards buildings, how they come already assembled and ready to go. All you have to do is set them on the layout. And then out here at the beach, I've added some some beach goers. A couple people there in the water or at the water's edge. Guys getting ready to come down. I know there's a few cracks here in my sand. Um, I'll get that smoothed out eventually. A couple more beachgoers over here coming down from the campground. Well, yeah, brought a little bit of life here to this section. Back out a little bit more here and kind of swing around. So other than that, I've been doing a little bit of ballasting and putting some bushes and vegetation here and there. And deciding on what I'm going to work on next because I got a, so many projects all around the layout as most of us probably do that I'm just trying to decide what direction to go next. I guess whatever tugs at my interest that's what I'm going to work on so Lately it's been scenery and corn and things like that. But I've been 
eyeing that bridge over there again, so I might go back and work on that. I still want to get the new turntable working, which is over in there. I don't know if you can see it, but it's there. And, you know, a bunch of other things. But we'll get there. I want to work on this house. I want to keep working on the station. I want to work on this. So, I'll get there. Here, we're back over by the bridge. So I'm thinking about working on the highway bridge that goes next to the next to the railway bridge and go right through here. And then it will curve off the layout. There's the new steam heater car that I recently did a review on. This is another area I'm thinking about working on. I'm, this is the Walther's Blast Furnace, or where it's going to go. These are just the base plates. You can see how big that's going to be. And of course, I got to finish the rolling mill and the engine house here and build another one of these cranes. Get an ore boat out here. This is quite a, quite a neat scene once it's done. So. Oh yeah, I planted a couple trees around. I think I mentioned that, but there's a couple over here on Layout B. Now Layout B doesn't seem to get a lot of love, or hasn't in a while. So I'm like, I want to stick a couple trees over there. It's because the layout is, you know, mostly scenic for now. So there's not a whole lot to do with it at this time. That will change. Some of the new trees are back in the corner there, those pine trees, and I did a few more just scattered around. But yeah, that's it. Another quick little update. Things are progressing um, slowly but steadily. So it all come together one of these days. Kind of look down the length of it here. Well, everybody, as always, thanks for watching. Like, share, comment. Enjoy the comments. And until the next time, everybody. Take care. Thanks for watching.